About 50% of Idaho's population ages 12 and up are fully vaccinated, leaving about 750,000 Idahoans without the shot. But with President Joe Biden's new plan requiring vaccinations, will Idaho's vaccine rate increase or will Governor Little put a stop to his COVID-19 plan in Idaho? You can always file a lawsuit, whether it's successful or not, is a whole nother question. Republican governors across the country announcing plans to potentially take legal action against President Biden's vaccine requirement unveiled last week, claiming it's an unconstitutional attack on personal freedom. Governor Little also exploring legal action, but it's unclear whether he will file a lawsuit alone or with other GOP governors. I think if Idaho brought an individual lawsuit, it could have a lot of problems given uh, the COVID numbers in our state, which have has caused a health crisis. It very well could be uh, uh, that Governor Little uh, sort of has some challenges of his own to deal with if he brings this lawsuit. It could really open the door uh, to information about decision making on this topic. In a press release, Little stated, I have been consistent that government should stay out of decisions involving employers and their employees as much as possible. And he goes on to say it is wrong for President Biden to dismiss the concerns of millions of Americans. Biden's requirement loops in OSHA, making it a public health and safety concern, and it could provide a basis for the president if challenged in court. OSHA could be uh, one of those pieces of federal law that the uh, president could point to. It will really depend on the requirements of that statute and what power it gives to the president and his agency. Uh, legally, these are unprecedented times. There are really no cases out there to draw on from the past uh, about uh, the legality of, of actions during a pandemic. Nicole Camarda, Idaho News 6.